What's up? <laughs> this is how it works. Have you guys ever like played with this before? No, should we do we do like the hi chance? <laughs> hi chance the snapper. He says hey. Um so you touch a tooth and it may or may not bite you. If it does bite you, then you have to answer a revealing question about do you guys call yourself a band? A trio? Depends on the day of the week. Honestly, okay. we have not settled upon a <laughs> I'm about a fellow category trio. For about us. a fellow trio member. I like yeah. let's let's go to trio for tonight. Yeah. And that's pretty much it. We can start with you and you can like take oh, it and yeah. pass it around. Cool. So what do you do? You press it down? Does it hurt? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and the tooth stays down. Oh. Yeah, it stays down. One of them every time will will bite. <gasps> one of them. Oh, it's Which only one. one. Yeah. Okay. Well, you you know the one I did because it's down. <gasps> uh oh. It's like Russian roulette. I feel like you're gonna Herbis. get it. The I feel like the probability is you're gonna. Oh no. Wait, and if we make it to the last one, we get to ask you a question. Oh, Ooh, Ooh, I kind of yeah. like that rule. Fine, I'll allow it. <laughs> Why is it gonna be me? All right, I'm gonna blow it right here because I want to answer something. I don't know. It's... Oh, oh, there's two left. Oh Wait. no way! <laughs> there's three. I can't count. Four. There's four. There's four. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm gonna count. I'm feeling good then. <laughs> what? Now I'm actually nervous. We're gonna do this. All right, as a gang, do we vote? We vote? No, so this is yours still. All right, let's go with the first one. No, no way. way. Is it broken? No, there's one more. This last one? <laughs> let's see it. <laughs> oh! oh! my god. Yo, someone run the Someone run that. that. That's insane. Yeah, let's go to Vegas. Can't let's go to Vegas. Show us wow. what it is. That's good luck, guys. Holy that's good shit, luck. that's insane. I'll stay true to my word. You guys can ask me an embarrassing question. I will be stealing this idea for future episodes too. Mm. So thank you for that. I'll check you out every welcome. episode. Which one of us do you like the most? <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. Here, I, this might not be a question, but I'll be honest here. As I was saying, like, I'm super stoked to have you in. We're at that point oh. where I can't just invite artists that I like on the show anymore. <laughs> yeah. Fortunately, you got to do favors for people. <laughs> <laughs> and one of them didn't share. I'm just saying like, I had 95 guests, okay? And like some of these people are signed to like major record labels, like they're they're pretty big deals. And this random ass artist who I really liked didn't acknowledge that they were on the podcast <laughs> after after that it went live. And I was uh, pissed. Like nothing? No, like I sent them a thank you email and respond to my thank you email. That's annoying. Uh, yeah. Does that count as my question? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. wait. <laughs> you don't have to publish that if you don't want to. That's yeah. No, I do. Really? No. Yeah, no. He's been waiting to say that. Believe, like, I do not believe in this is a safe space. for social media. I Hell like yeah. Very yeah. Neither do we. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> that was great. Wow. Thank you guys for letting me vent there. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Anytime. Where did it go? Oh, it's in your hand. All right. Let's go speed round. <sighs> if this happens again, that's. Oh, uh, speed round. You Did you put down two? Oh, yeah. Kiki, just hold it. I think I put down two. Oh! oh! Okay. <laughs> that was scary, guys. <laughs> Kiki, who in the trio is the worst cook or eats the weirdest food combinations? Justin. Why? Because he doesn't cook. <laughs> He's recently started. I said Justin, but no one's a bad cook, but he cooks the least. What is like your specialty if you're if you have a limited menu? Kind of started cooking just last few months. Just <laughs> I've been in the kitchen. Just kind of just copping off my roommates, like a lot of mess. My, my other roommates are great cooks, so I'm kind of just learning from them. But uh, yes, yeah, steak, eggs, potatoes. Eggs, eggs is, is such an easy one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last night I made the biggest meal I've ever had. It was like a pound of ground beef. It was like a massive potato. Did you eat the full pound? I ate the full pound, dude. <laughs> and three eggs. Oh, you're gonna be dunking into avocado. I literally, <laughs> I weighed myself. I gained eight pounds yesterday. <laughs> I'm not even lying. I'm not even asking. Is that possible? I did. I mean, it's water weight and food weight, but yeah. You hit 140? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can we get Cam over we here? Get Cam this is our first. fourth member. Come on in. Do we do you can come thing? over, but you have to join the game. What up, guys? Quick hot seat for you. Were you managing before you reached out to them? No. So my first guys. No and shit. Girl. That's sick. So yeah, I, inclusion. Long story short, basically, I had a bunch of their music saved, and I was looking for artists to manage. I had a couple of friends in the industry that I learned from. I remember I was like in my room. I spent like two days drafting out this email, this whole <laughs> DM. I was like so nervous. DM them, emailed them, left on red. Yeah. There's a ghost. Yeah. Who are these guys? <laughs> left there for like a couple Not weeks. Not even unopened. Follow red. up. Followed up. Got a reply. Hopped on a call. It was with Justin. I hop on the call. I'm like, 
what's going on in the background? It's like the guy's outside somewhere, something's happening. He was playing pickup. He's like, yo, what's up? Like, have a call. I'm like literally sitting. I was like, I think I was in Florida visiting a friend and I was like sitting on his balcony, like with my laptop. I had like notes up. It was a whole thing. And I was like ready for this call. And this guy's like, we just, yo, what's up? What's up? He's like, oh yeah, I think I like you. He's like, we'll have another call in a couple of weeks. That call came around. They canceled on me. I remember. <laughs> And then, and then I had another call with him and Matt. It was good. I mean, I was like, it felt good. I don't know like what inclined me, but it just felt right. And then at the end of that call, I was like, yo, like I'll uh, come out there and meet you guys. So I flew out there, moved Came them in, us. rented a car, drove to Santa Barbara where they were, went to their house and like pitched them for Kiki, Kiki and I were Dude. in the middle of the biggest fight we've oh ever been in. <laughs> Justin wasn't there and so it was Justin just Matt there. and I meeting Cam and like we had to just like he's at the door and Matt and I are like all right game faces like, like we the day, gotta, we gotta the, day of the, the day came where I was supposed to go and no one was replying me to be with an address <laughs> so in my match just put in Santa Barbara then they gave me the address and I can it was the whole thing but it all turned out well and, and that's then, why they yeah. needed a manager all, all jokes aside yeah Cam DMing us and coming into our lives has been probably like the most important part of the thing yeah, that's ever happened to Zaywo and we are yeah. well, eternally grateful there as we, we always say Lizaywo is for people I would be nothing without them and you know they gave me a chance it's been obviously you know going well so far and like there's been you know a lot of there's a lot of potential here I think for everyone and like we're, we're family so it's yeah. it's been you know I've changed the course of my life for them you know I moved from Dallas out here so it's been it's been good that's baller as fuck dude good for you yeah. I that's yeah. some serious grind to do that yeah it's crazy I think sometimes we don't like sit back and recognize you know what we've accomplished I know I'm not, I'm not really good at that and we've done that better lately and like yeah that being said now that you're on the mic i'm just gonna veto the crocodile and ask oh, you yeah. a, a, a hot seat question which member of the trio sends the most drunk texts <laughs> matt i think matt yeah are they happy drunk texts it's more like who's yeah. we, we, we all, I where we, are people it's like we can't find <laughs> people so we, that's we take turns yeah i feel like we've all we've all gone through our different like phases of being like the biggest menace i mean our group chat is you don't want to see that thing <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Where is everyone? <laughs> All right, and then I'll end it with this one, which I'm also going to have you answer. Tell me or tell us, the listeners at home, something that we don't know about Lizewo. About them as a whole? Or about them as a whole. But I mean, feel, you feel free to like. Yeah, you don't really have to dig, get personal on this one. Deep, get personal. <laughs> Thinking about how to ruin us. <laughs> answer. Cancel yourself. Um, I think, honestly, to spin that a little bit, I think what they're really good at. Is connecting with their fans. I knew. I, listen, I respect that answer, but I knew you were gonna say something positive. <laughs> but that's okay. No, I'll, I'll, <laughs> tell me, tell me though, why? Like, what do you think makes them really good at connecting with their fans? They all have a very good understanding that in this day and age with music, I think before there was an advantage to be more mysterious and yeah. almost not having like access as a fan, and that was like coveted. But now with social media, with the DMs, like all of that. It's almost it works against you if you don't do that. Yeah. And the three of them together very much know that and like just replying to DMs, interacting with fans, doing meet and greets, like, you know, makes my life a lot easier when they're like that and they have, you know, very personal personalities. I don't think negative the same, man. Yeah. Well, no, that's honestly that's awesome. Yeah. That's a, yeah. You know, they want I mean, some dirt. I yeah. well first off, I'll commend you guys. Congrats for oh, being thanks. so good as your fan. But yeah, lay it on me. Give me the dirt. Sweet. Uh no, yeah, I feel like I feel like hardly anyone knows this, but back when we were um, so we live in Los Angeles now, but prior to that we lived in Santa Barbara where we all where we all met. And the three of us uh, attempted to live together and with a couple uh, other roommates yeah, as well. Know that, so. And as a result of different <laughs> lifestyles and <laughs> numerous other things, it went absolutely horribly. It and went so bad shape. Friendships were almost ended <laughs> and oh, God, bands God. were almost done, kaput. demolished. <laughs> yeah. So we were I enemies. actually pulled up to their house for the first time, little did I know that it was on the verge of just not being a thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then don't live with your bandmates. The best thing to do is with your female bandmates. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'm just kidding. I'm just to be fair, they still live together. No, <laughs> imagine, yeah. imagine she was living in a house with like five guys. Yeah, <laughs> and that was still in college. It was my senior year. Yeah, I was an absolute menace. I was, I was very inconsiderate. Fresh, of I was fresh out of college, also a menace. It was honestly, I think things went downhill when we got a beer bong. Yeah, and the slip and slide uh, outside. The beer bong and the slip and slide. That's what takes it so downhill. <laughs> We're, we're, we're wholesome. Over. We made it through it. We made it through it. Yeah. Yeah. We are stronger yeah. because of it. Oh, 100%. And we now know the proper distance to live away from each other is about a yeah. six minute drive. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's say, well, 
thank you so much for coming into the music music studio what can i expect from your set tonight at the grand um just like perfection. really good songs <laughs> perfection <laughs> no, I, no it's good. and also no after after this uh, wonderful conversation we've had which we've absolutely loved by yeah, the way thank yeah. you for having us could, of course the vibes right, cannot be higher yeah. i personally couldn't be more excited to throw the fuck down fuck tonight yeah. Yeah. i'm and glad it's gonna be a very high energy night that's yeah. gonna make you dance and cry and shout and yeah. All right, sweet. Well, that's it. Uh, we can wrap. Yeah.